once again you are welcome to my youtube channel queen rami talks guys thank you so much for all the love that we are receiving on this channel it's good to watch you guys are more than welcome as you can see it's a full house today okay who are you sir i'm mr lvm as you know me and the beautiful lady in the corner my name is Carol. Some of you know me as Aniki. Whichever name you prefer is perfect for me. Oh yes, oh yes. This is my beautiful cousin and my wonderful... <coughs> okay guys, we are going to toast. <coughs> oh yes, cheers. <laughs> guys, as you saw on the title of this video, today we are not playing. You know, today we want the truth from this man. You know, not only him. So he's representing all the men all over. So yeah, we'll be asking him juicy questions. Mm -hmm. Guys, parental guidance. If you're way too young, don't, don't be on this video. Eh? <laughs> I'm playing, guys. We'll be asking him any question that a lot of ladies are afraid to ask their men. Okay, are you ready, guys? Are ready, you ready, Mr. Ready. Albia? Yeah? I'm ready. Okay, my first question. So I'll be asking him a question and Carol will be asking him also. So it's in between the both of us. Okay. So my first question is, does a woman's weight matter to a man or is it just a matter of preference? Um, from a man's perspective. Okay. Uh, beauty comes in all shapes. Yes. And sizes. Okay. It depends on an individual that he prefers the middle body or, you know, or the short one or the long one. It depends <laughs> on a person. So it's, it's preference. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Okay, so if, let me just add a little bit. So if as a woman you meet me looking all good and then I gain weight, does it mean I'm no longer what you are preferring? I believe that it tests, Who, it gauges, the man. yeah, the man. That is, is he in love with the weight or what? Though the weight is important that a person can take care of him uh, herself. Okay. But what I'm saying is that you can't crucify a person because they've gained a, a little bit of weight or whatever reason, you know. So those things is subject that as a couple you can talk about it that please at least let's maintain, let's do some gymming or let's trim ourselves or let's maintain the weight, you know. It must not exceed that much. So it depends on uh, uh, people who are in love or the couple. Okay, themselves. no, fully answered, fully answered. Okay, because it's your next, it's your turn. Okay, Mr. LVM, tell mm -hmm. us. Is it a good idea for a woman to tell a man how she feels about them? As in, Ukshela, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, very interesting. Ladies, listen. <laughs> that one is very interesting. Uh, um, what I can say. Uh, ladies, I can suggest this, that you, you can show the interest, you know, or woo that person close just to make him aware that this is what you have, but you must have, you must be diplomatic about it. Most of the time as African, especially Africans, uh, mm -hmm. it's a, it's a taboo, you know. For a woman yes, yes, to yes. go after a, a man and tell the man that yes, I love you or whatever, you know. Though sometimes it works for others, but you know this African culture. I think that's the thing that those strings are tied. But it does happen for some. It works those who go out for what they want, mm. and it works for them. But others. They are able to do it diplomatically until the guy himself, he sees that, oh, this one has interest. So I think I can come in there. So showing is good, but saying it, it's not good. Is that what you're saying? For some, it's good. For some, it's not good. So it's different strokes for different folks. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. What works for the other 
cannot work for the other. Yeah, but true. yeah, so yeah, it differs from person to person. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Mm. All right, all right. <laughs> Next question. How do men feel about our fuzzy basuzayo? Women who are always passing gas. <laughs> Because you know what, guys? I once heard a guy saying, I left that lady because she passes gas a lot. We are Susa, that woman. So, how do men feel about this thing? <laughs> Don't expose him. Okay. Uh, I think for me, I take it as a natural, you know, process. That I mean, the carbon dioxide is coming out. And you know what I'm saying? Mm. For me, I know that uh, if a person does that, it shows that they are very healthy. Oh, yeah, feel. Yeah. So, <laughs> but it depends. You know, others they cannot, you know, uh, uh, comprehend that or deal with that. Ah, oh, this one is fatting too much. Um, you know, I mean, but it's a natural process. So when is it too much, Masters are good you are. When is it too much? No, I mean to fat. You cannot say I want to cram when <laughs> and where I will fat. Some 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 of the people when they fat, it's silence. Mm. But it makes. I agree with Mr. LBM. I mean, it's nature, guys. So feel free, feel free to open up whenever you feel like opening up. Like guys, this is not a myth. Some couples. From what I know, they have to go to the bathroom to pass gas. I mean, there is a couple, a celebrity that I know for sure who confessed that he goes to the toilet and suggests that the woman does the same. Mm. So imagine, so I, I, we are not going to be discussing people. We are moving right along. Because right the next along. question. Okay, Mr. LVM. So mm -hmm. according to you, sir, mm. kindly tell us, why do men... Do hit and run. Okay. Hit and run as in one night stand. Okay. Um, for those, to oh, my observation. Booze. Yeah. No. I think we all need a drink, guys. Get your drinks. It's going to be hot in here. I go late. Love your sister. This one is a juicy question. Mm. But for me, those people who are doing those one night stand or Hit and run. Firstly, I think they don't want to be um, responsible or to be in a relationship whereby they are tied up. They want, you know, they just want that. Um, yeah. One night stand and that's it. There are no strings attached and what what. But do you tell a woman you are a one night stand or it just happens and then you block her tomorrow? Yeah. That's After unfair. the day goes to them. You know Guys, what I'm saying? Guys, repent. <laughs> Rest, rest, I rest, rest, I rest, I rest. <laughs> no, guys, it's wrong. Like, you know, at least be honest with someone that you know what we are not going anywhere. Yes, I'm I just, agree. you know, I'm thirsty and I just want you for tonight. I Those agree. who do clapping, they must be honest and say, I'm thirsty, you know. I mean, okay, another one that I will add to this question do women do hit and run on men? <laughs> yeah, yeah, they do. And the, the, the issue is, the guy says, I did hit and run, and the woman says, I hit him. Nah, so they no. hit each other. <laughs> and no, that's no not <laughs> Yes! Whose <laughs> <laughs> turn is it? Yours. It's yours. Okay. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. My question goes. Should ladies take men who DM them serious? DM as in inbox from social media. Should they take it serious? Yeah, you know, <laughs> so, so, some of these things, as I will say that, you know, some of the people, they, they, they have relationships or they find love through media. It like works who? for some, <laughs> especially for us. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but not that, That's a video for another day. Yeah, but not that you reach out to me. I reach out to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I pursued. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So it is the same way that I can say that uh, what worked for us cannot work for, for the other. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But you just you use a channel that works for you. Mm. So, but what I'm saying is that uh, most of the time, 
other other ladies they do reach out and show interest that I'm interested and uh, I mean as I was saying that it works for some but okay. for some it doesn't work mm. you know so I believe that you do what works for you as an individual yeah correct so yeah. ladies answer the DMs answer you know <laughs> okay okay next cast bring it on okay <sighs> My next question to you, Mr. LVM, is... Because right. is it the last one or are you still safe on your side? Um, you still have? I still have... No, no, no. Yeah, I still, I, I still have another one. Okay, okay. Please go ahead. Does it really matter to a guy what his lady posts on her social media? Mm. E.g. like um, your pictures in swimwear or lingerie or pajamas does it really matter good question yeah okay oh. can i just please elaborate on this let's say um what she posts before let's say for a couple that meets on social media mm. do you check her pictures what she posts there or, or what happens and then also after like she asked does it matter what she posts all right, um, <clears throat> I would say that, uh, yeah, this one is a, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's tight, you know, but it's right. Mm. Uh, but what I can say is that um, sometimes I will, a, a guy will be interested to a lady while she is wearing a swimsuit. I say, wow. Mm. And then he gets interested. Mm -hmm. I don't think it would be a problem even after if that lady posts those pictures i mean he found her doing that okay. and he must accept that you know what i'm saying yeah like for instance if i i find i as i've found you you are beautiful you take care of yourself mm. if now we are in a relationship i have a problem with you wearing you know the, mm. the, the weaves, weaves and mm. you put on your you know mm. whatever your makeup and I need, to, I need to deal with that because I found you in that mode. So I must enhance that. So now I, I can't have a problem with you having those things because I found you in that level. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. I, I'm not fully answered, but let's say um, you saw a picture of me in a bikini. Is it lust or is it love? What draw you to me? What is it that called you to come and talk to me? Okay. Because some will say, you are saying to men, I'm available when you post a bikini. Mm -hmm. And that's mm -hmm. not the case. Mm -hmm. We can't wear uh, jeans to the beach, guys. No, we, we can't, can't swim with hey, jeans. We, can't. Yeah. we just need to show ourselves. You know? Yeah. Show ourselves. And, and we're not saying we want men. For men. Exactly. We are doing it for ourselves. Yeah. Exactly. Like Kazi said, we cannot go to the swimming pool or to the beach wearing a jean. It's just not possible. Ladies, do not do it. Say, ma, don't hey, ma. do it. <laughs> All right. I like her. She's coming back on the channel. I just want to add on yeah, yeah, to please. the content mm. that last, the last, mm. last doesn't last. Yeah, but true. But love lasts. Correct. Oh. Mm, nice oh. one. So mm. uh, I believe that the intentions of a person are determined or are weighed, are gauged mm. by time because time will reveal mm. the, the intentions. Yes. Of a person that's yeah. powerful want to add something cuz I guess it also brings me to the last question that I had for mr. LVM okay you can break it it's, down yeah it's regarding because uh, I heard you touching a little bit on it with the weave and stuff mm. do men prefer women to be natural or do they prefer them with weaves do they like makeup do mm. they prefer them with a clean face just vaselina mm. and <laughs> shining the whole day you without know? any makeup mm. and whatnot mm. like what question mm. what do men really want yeah or mm. what do most men yeah appreciate okay yeah most <laughs> uh, as i will say that beauty comes in all shapes and sizes so it depends on an individual that uh, you love the uh, a lady who who wears makeup, mm. weaves, 
and whatever. But I believe that even if a person is not wearing makeup, if you love a person, you love them because in the uh, on on bedtime, you know, you don't wear those makeup. things. You yes, are natural. A cheers so uh, yeah, from yeah. LVM. So <laughs> you, definitely. Oh so yes. Your love must be consistent. <laughs> correct. Correct. Mm. Yeah. That's so profound. Mm. It is, it is. Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm. Do okay. we still have more questions for Mr. LVM? Oh, we... yes, we do. Oh, yes, we do. We are far from being done. <laughs> is it sweating? Are you sweating, no, Mr. I'm not LVM? Sweating. I'm, are you I'm okay? enjoying the oh. You need ice. <laughs> okay, okay. So, how long does it take for a man to know if he has met the one? Ice for no one. I. Yeah. Uh, you know, as I'll say, mm. different strokes for different folks. Yeah. There's what we call, um, how can I put it? Um, love at first sight. <laughs> <laughs> does it still exist? Yeah, it does. Okay. And uh, there are others that you know you grow to love the person. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, you fall in love with mm -hmm. the person. But, you know, with time. Okay. But... It doesn't mean that you just say, Lord, let me give time, but I don't feel anything. There's something, but you grow more okay. in this thing. Mm. But there is that one-time connection and things are just booming, okay. you know. So, yeah, it differs from person to, to person. person. Yeah. So, yeah. So, why are guys taking so long? I mean, I mean, it's part of my last question. Mm. It's saying, um, why do a lot of men take time to settle down? Yeah, you, you will understand. Men, they are procrastinators. Pro okay. Procrastinators. <laughs> okay. I mean, I mean <laughs> a man, he knows that he needs to do the thing, things right now. Okay. But he'll say, I st I'm still thinking about it. Yo. You will always even go to the grave. Thinking, thinking about, about, exactly. about it. Men are like that. They like to delay, to take time. I'm still thinking about it, you know. But, mm -hmm. okay, so sorry to, to cut you there. Okay. While you are thinking about it, Joseph wants an answer that side. That's so what do we do? That's where the problem <laughs> Joseph is. Joseph is busy proposing marriage, mm -hmm. but, mm -hmm. you know. While I'm still thinking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does happen to men. And I think when now he sees that, you know, now I'm losing the game. He starts to pass you now because he sees that <laughs> there's a challenge, you know. Uh, men are like that. Men love to be challenged. Yeah, yeah. yeah Ladies, no, challenge no. them. Send yourself a message and say it's from Joseph. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, but hey, guys, this was very, very interesting. Eh? Yes, it So, Kazi, in closing, what has this taught you about men? Oh my goodness, wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, um, what I can say is, um, what I've learned today is that obviously uh, each and every man has their own choice, yes. if I can put it that way. Correct. But... Um, to add more to that, I can also say that uh, as a man, like, as a man, if you are to, especially when it comes to pursuing a woman, if you are to pursue a woman, please do not waste our time. Yes. We do not want to be wasted time on. We do not Correct. want that from men. Please. Amazing. Marry us. Yes. Cut to the chase. Cut to the chase. That's so powerful. Guys, Nizri, like it. Come on. That's right. Okay, my love. What are your last words? Um, what have you learned through this challenge? And what is it that you think women want from men? They want men who are specific, Correct. who know what they want. Mm -hmm. And another thing, but that I will add on is that I believe that we need to know the difference between men and a woman. Mm. Because we are wired differently. Very. And if we can explore those dimensions and dynamics, yes. then things will be better because we'll be dealing <laughs> with each other with understanding. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, guys, thank you so much for your time. I hope you will be back soon on this channel. Um, guys, I hope you watch till the end. Of course, we've got visitors. We can't do shout outs today, guys. But thank you so much for liking our videos, for commenting, and for subscribing. Until we meet again, guys, let's give them a cheers. Yeah.